This is Joe. Joe likes to illegally download unlicensed copies of movies. He especially likes to use his work computer to do this, as the download speed is faster in the office. If his company doesn't know that he is doing this, can they be held legally responsible for his downloads? This is Bob. Bob is a PhD student whose research involves DNA sequencing. To make it easier to share his large data files, he stores them in his personal Dropbox account. When Bob graduates from university, he forgets to transfer back his research data from Dropbox. Should the university forbid the use of personal storage accounts by staff and students in order to protect their intellectual property? This is Mary. Mary's mother has just passed away, and she is trying to access her social media accounts to download some personal photos and close the accounts. But many of the social media sites tell Mary she is not allowed to access her mother's information. Who owns your digital life? And who should be able to access it after you die? Join us at the 2016 Cyber Summit in Banff to learn about the ethical, security and privacy implications of technologies related to online data, cybersecurity, and the Internet of Things. Visit cybera.ca forward slash cyber summit for more information.